Hey everyone, how are you doing today? I'm Life in NPC and we are back with some more Runaway Teen Pregnancy Challenge and Tiana is not having the best time. She is currently deep in labour and she's about to go to the bathroom. So we're about to give birth. Look how big her belly is. She's just doing the pregnancy walk and it's so ironic. We came out here to talk to our friends. We just announced to our friends that we're pregnant and now we're about to be like, oh yeah, by the way guys, um, about to pop this baby out. My water spilled all over the floor. I think we need to tell Lauren. We need to be like, Lauren, oh my gosh, like, we're in labor. What are we gonna do? Complain about problems. Like, Lauren, I'm in labor, help me. Tiana's just at the back like, um, guys, guys, are you listening to me? Um, hello? And they're all just having the time of their life, having a conversation. She's like, um, pregnant lady here. She's like, Lauren, can you come over here, please? Like, there's something really urgent I need to tell you that I have to go all the way upstairs for, apparently. Okay, okay. Well, the Sims does what the Sims wants, and all we do is follow their commands. Oh no, Amari and chat I mean, Charles was there when our water broke, so he knows already. Anyway, Amari, our crush, is about to find out that we're about to give her birth. Oh my gosh. Like, Lauren, I've been late. Oop, and Aria knows too now. He's like, okay, let's go to the hospital. Quick, we need to go, go, go. And we're bringing Lauren with us. Yeah. Lauren's been with us from since day one. Lauren's the only reason we've got money. Of course we're bringing Lauren with us. Anyway, I'll see you guys over there. Tiana is probably terrified. Being 16 and just being like, oh, well, time to pop a baby out of me. Lauren is living life. Shine, Lauren, shine. Welcome to the clinic. Feel free to make yourself comfortable and ask one of our obstetricians if you need anything. You can try doing some labor-inducing activities, such as taking a walk or doing exercise on a birthing ball. You will go into active labor once you are 10 centimeters dilated okay i feel like tiana she's like so impatient she's like i just want this baby out of me like please like i just want to give birth now this is so horrible this is so uncomfortable i don't want to be here prom is starting um well you see i know i think who did we say we said we were going to go to prom with someone didn't we lauren was going to go with gavin i think we might have been going with amari the tricky situation about this is we're in labor we kind of can't make it to prom i'm sure the boys will understand why we can't go to prom today so tiana is struggling because she decided to come here on her own she was like i'm gonna recline on an exam bed this this is this is painful i just don't want to anymore Oh, poor girl. Look look how stressed and sad she is. Don't worry, girl. The baby will come out eventually. Oh, how naive I really was. I thought this was going to be a quick, easy, and breezy labor. But no, Miss Tiana labored for, I believe, over 48 hours. Guys, just brace yourself. Feeling scared, the contraptions have started and the pain is more than Tiana expected. She's having trouble understanding what is happening to her body and her mind keeps racing to all the ways things can go wrong. Oh my god. Honestly, you have every right to be scared, terrified. Um, and then we've got this one contraction pain so we're about to find out how dilated we are and then i think tiana's gonna have a conversation with lauren because she's considering an epidural but she doesn't know if she should get it or not like okay we're being checked she's like do you think it's a good idea should i should i get the epidural we are one centimeter dilated so basically we're gonna be here for a while lauren's trying to brighten up the mood she's like hey look at this really cool video and we're like yeah that is funny like lauren's such a good friend she's really trying her best to like keep our minds off of like the situation um we're gonna have a deep conversation like lauren i don't know what to do should i have an epidural and we're gonna see lauren's reaction to find out she's like yeah why not like this is like a stressful situation enough there's no point making yourself go through more pain and stress than what you're you've, you're already having and she's like okay thanks lauren but she's still gonna think about it for a little more um and we're gonna exercise on the birthing ball okay so it's been like a couple sim hours i think since we got in here tiana is hungry she's tired like they didn't even offer us any food oh tiana is so sad like look at her she's just she's just sorrowfully staring at her food eating it 
in pain probably from both contractions and the fact that she's still processing she's gonna have to look after a little human after this all right let's see oh it hurts from going into labor tiana is in a lot of pain right now so much pain that it's making her want to cry oh <laughs> if tiana has a companion get them over here quick having some support will really help her navigating her contractions tiana's like lauren i just need some help she's like of course i've got you it's gonna be okay i promise don't worry we're gonna make it through this the baby's gonna be fine and we're just gonna keep living our life she's like i know i know but it hurts so much i'm so stressed i don't even want to think about anything and i was like it's okay we're gonna make it through together i've got your back always oh tiana's struggling but lauren's here for her so finish swaying uh, lauren are you feeling flirty She's ovulating. Lauren, don't get any ideas. <gasps> no! Oh my gosh, Tiana! Uh, not in the hospital lobby room. Oh my gosh. I'm such a bad simmer. I'm sorry, Tiana. I put you in this situation. Let's see. We're going to ask for the epidural. Or actually, I'll, I'll wait to see what her moodlets are. We're going to ask to have our dilation checked. And I kind of want her to decide... If she gets another, like, really uncomfortable or sad moodlet, then I will, you know, get her to have an epidural. Because then it's, like, her decision, you know? So we're just getting our dilation checked. Okay, how far dilated are we? Oh my gosh, are you kidding me? Two We've been here since, like, 8pm. It's now 1am and we're only two centimetres dilated. Oh gosh, girl, just go back to sleep. I'm done. Why is this taking so long? She can't help but snap at everything and everyone around them. We can complain about problems some more. She's like, Lauren, I hate this. I'm so mad. Why? I hate, how did, why would Tyrese do this to me? I can't believe it. Like, if it wasn't for him, I wouldn't be in this situation. Like, and Lauren's like, oh, let's lighten up the mood. It's okay. I know it's tough, but you'll make it through. And Tiana's like, I, no, just stop, Lauren. You're, you're annoying me now. I don't want to talk to you. <laughs> Lauren's just keep, still trying. She's just like, Lauren, stop. Like, you're getting on my nerves. Enough is enough. I'm so over it. Oh, she's feeling scared again. Scared. Self-doubt. Oh, circles back to how badly her body hurts. Oh, girl. Let's do some breathing exercises. She had to go into her athletic work to do breathing exercises. Oh, poor girl. Oh, poor Tiana. Okay, she's sitting down now. Man, I feel so bad for her. Like, why don't I put my Sims in situations like this? No, she's kind of getting desperate. She's like, please, how dilated am I? Okay, so we're getting our dilation checked yet again. Hopefully, it's better news this time. Because last time we, we were here for like four hours and... Okay, six centimeters. Right. So we got our dilation checked at 1, 1 a.m. and it was 2. It's now 8 a.m. and it's only 6. Tiana is... Oh, she's so frustrated. I heard you became friends of Charles. Okay, cool. But now is not the time, Amari. Remember, labor. Come on now. Can we social bunny post about being in labor? I doubt it, but that'd be so funny. No, see, we can't make a new post. Oh my gosh, look what Amari said. Please just go back into your house and remove the door. No one wants to see you in public. Oh my gosh, that's that's so mean. Is this because we like ditched you at prom? I don't even remember if we said we we're going to go to prom with Amari. But geez, that's so mean. And our labor, our pregnancy symptoms are going to make us be mean back. Your follower account and you are the same. A big zero. I mean, Tiana so is yours. That doesn't really make sense, but whatever. We're like, oh, I can't believe that guy. Like, I'm over here delivering a baby and he's complaining about prom. The entitlement. Okay, so Tiana needs a shower and to eat. I think we're going to eat before we shower because our hunger goes down quite fast. And like, we'll have a cup noodle. And then, are there even showers here? There should be showers because the patients, some like overnight patients who need special care, they still need to be able to clean themselves okay okay so i went on a little tangent because this bathroom didn't make sense first it was only one bathroom for a hospital with such such a big hospital like the queues would have been horrendous no sense also there's no shower sure i just added this sort of shower I could probably add like a proper shower but like it's a hospital you might have overnight patients who are going to need to cleanse a shower just makes sense 
Um, and then I just moved the sink over here. So boom, you got cubicles and this. I read online about this farmer that plays at the flea market. Sorry, we can't go. Tiana's in labor. Like, I know it's been like almost 12 hours, but like, she's just not dilating. I don't know what to do. Mars like, okay. Oh, hot and heavy dreaming. Tiana's dreams bring her to a state of nirvana as they recollect their cherished moments with Omari Lyles. Oh, it's almost surreal. Oh my gosh. That's kind of cute. She's like in pain, in labor, about to give birth um, to her child, but she's thinking about Omari. That message he sent must have really gotten to her. She must have been like so upset. Because she she really does have a crush on him. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, why are you asking me? I'm not Amari. Oh, what? Why are they at the hospital? And why did I have to be in <gasps> involved in this, guys? Okay, so it happened in a weird way. But I'm just gonna say her friends came to visit her because you know they were scared. It's just Amari and Sienna. Um. But yeah, they just they just appeared. They just came here. And I think that's so sweet. Like, oh my gosh. So like she's gonna be like, oh, she's just asleep right now. Oh my gosh, no, that's crazy. Guys, remember she was dreaming about Amari and now she's here. She's gonna be like, what the heck? Manifestation. Tiana's gonna come out and be like, oh my gosh, what are you guys doing here? She's like, no way. Did you guys come to visit me? Oh, contractions, contractions. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure that's exactly how it went down. Tiana will be like, whoa. Like, do you want to film my baby? It's so nice seeing them all speak with each other. It's so nice having everyone here together. Tiana, even though she looks sad right now, she's very grateful because she's been feeling very lonely through this whole journey. She's only had Lauren. She couldn't turn to her parents. She couldn't rely on Tyrese. He, Tyrese did the unspeakable to her and ended up putting her in this situation. And... She just needs a minute to process things. She just left the room. Lauren knows how sad it is and she, that's why she's upset. So yet again, we are getting our dilation checked. I really hope it's better news. We were six last time. I think it was at 8 a.m. Oh my gosh, we're nine centimeters. <gasps> we're going to meet the baby. We're going to meet the baby. Oh my gosh, I feel like this episode is just going to be all just labor look at her face <laughs> when your crust agrees to feel your pregnant belly she's like yeah feel my belly <laughs> so i guess in the end she didn't get an epidural contraction pains from active labor tiana feels the inside of her body being lit on fire and ripped apart simultaneously she's done with this whole situation and is ready to get it over with oh my gosh are we fully dilated I mean, we can still ask for an epidural. She's like, hit me up now. I need the epidural. She's like, get off the computer and epiduralize me. This doctor is just playing on the computer. And Tiana's like, yo, I need my epidural now. Like, hello. She's like, oh, yeah, how are you? She's like, um, I want to stop feeling pain, please. She's like, oh, yeah, sure. Let's get it done. Because we think we in active labor. We got to move it for it. Okay, we are about to get our epidural. Pain relief from receiving epidural. Finally, some pain relief. Getting the epidural didn't hurt at all. One of our friends, please give us some food. Amari. You know, she's, we're gonna, okay, I'm going to quickly control Amari. I'm gonna be like, he heard Tiana saying she's hungry, so he's gonna maybe buy a snack from the vending machine for her. So Tiana's had her epidural. Don't ask me how she's still standing. But Amari brought us a sandwich um, because we were hungry. Where are you going? All right, hopefully this is our last time to get our dilation checked because we've been here for over 24 hours now. Tiana has had enough. Honestly, me too, sis. Okay, what's she saying? How dilated are we? You are fully dilated. Let's take you to one of our obstetricians and get you into labor right away. Guys, it's the moment of truth. I'm gonna turn headline effects off. Guys, it's really happening. Oh my gosh, it's happening. Oh my gosh, sorry, I need to get screenshots. I know this isn't as immersive, but... Okay, here we go. She's giving birth. Amari's in here, stress. Me too. The baby out. Come on, Tiana, you've got this girl. <gasps> Guys, we got a baby girl. 
We got a little baby girl. So I asked in the comments for some name suggestions in the last video and Brandy has given us some names. I love the name Serenity. So if you search it up, Serenity means peaceful and it's just, oh, I love that name. I feel like it'll make sense as well because Tiana's been in such a stressful situation. All her life has just been stress and pain, abuse and this baby that she was not ready for she she knows in her heart's gonna be her peace serenity will bring tiana true peace oh baby serenity oh my gosh the baby's literally coming out oh my gosh will that demonetize me guys look at serenity look at serenity let's get let's get the baby's face oh my <gasps> look at her eyes Look at Serenity's little eyes. She's so precious. Amari's just stood not knowing what to think. He's like, I never want to see something that gross ever again in my life. Oh man, this is... This is so... Oh, I love it. Okay, guys, we're back home. Yes, that is home. From the hospital. Baby Serenity is here. She's in the cutest little crib. Oh, baby Serenity. Welcome to the world, Serenity. We're gonna go, oh, we're gonna go talk to her. And while we do that, we need Lauren to paint, 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 because we we need to paint and sell so that we can afford another room. Because Brandy also suggested we get another room so that Lauren's not waking up whenever the baby cries this is so cute oh look tiana looks unsure she's like is this how you hold a baby it's like i know this is my child but i this is this is not a situation that i would expect it to ever be in oh, she's so cute beautiful beautiful serenity i'm obsessed with this baby I'm literally obsessed with this baby. Can we social bunny about giving birth? Is that a thing? New post? <gasps> post about new baby. We're gonna do a happy one. We're not excited, but we're not stressed anymore. We're just like, it is what it is. We're like, our baby's here. I've got a new bundle of joy lighting up my life. Diaper donations, welcome. And we're gonna send some nice message. We're gonna send a flirt message to Amari as a thank you for him coming. I'm also gonna send a friendly message to Sienna, like, thank you so much for coming, like, for real. <gasps> Baby print, oh my gosh! This is so cute, and we've got our birth certificate. Oh, serenity. I'm gonna put our birth certificate above the print. Oh, this is so precious. So, sell have a speedy shower and as you do that i'm going to expand the house so this house actually turned out way better than i expected i just added an extra room shift some stuff around to make the design make sense i want to make sure there was space for both serenity and for tiana in one room and so that lauren can have her own room so she won't get disturbed by the baby but i wish i could have added windows but oh well even just this you know it's fine it's fine they will get windows one day today is not that day but their house is much much nicer now they've got separate bedrooms they've got a roof over their head finally the baby's born baby's healthy baby's probably happy oh baby has a stinky nappy okay thank you all so so much for watching this video be sure to like and subscribe and leave a comment down below on what we should do next what is tiana going to do in the next chapter of her life Give me some suggestions, some gameplay suggestions. Do you think we should pursue Amari? Um, he may not be our forever person, but he might be, you never know. Or he could just be a, another teen romance. I'm so excited for Serenity to just grow up and experience life. And we can get started with the actual growing together stuff. Because I don't know if you knew, but this series is actually meant to be following growing together. And, and we've only had a child now on whatever episode this is <laughs> which is insane but if you like my content please 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 do subscribe leave a comment like the video share it with a friend follow me on threads yes i have threads so i will link my threads in the description anyway peace out bye